Hey guys, it's a bus jockey. Um, I was working on another bus today. I uh, had a check engine code on a 40 foot new flyer, and I've got a 278 code, which is for the uh, lift pump uh, electrical circuit. So, uh, first thing I did was I uh, checked uh, the wiring, of course, did a visual. Didn't find anything obviously wrong. So what I did was is I uh, hooked up my uh, Pico scope, and uh, I don't have everything hooked up right now, but I already checked it. But I figured I'd just give you guys a gander of what I'm doing. Um, I uh, plugged in a breakout lead uh, to the electrical lift pump connector, and then I scoped uh, the power ground uh, current at the uh, lift pump, and then. I hooked up my uh, WPS 500 right here to the uh, gear pump uh, pressure port uh, for the uh, the low side fuel pressure that feeds this pump. Okay, so I uh, did my trace, did my capture. Let me uh, go down in here. I'll show you where I connected at. <sighs> I thought about trying to show you guys the repair while I did it, but it's just going to be too much of a pain in the butt. It's confined and everything, that, and I'm afraid I'm going to break my camera. So, um, I figured this would be the next best thing I could do. So anyway, if you look here where my uh, wrench is at, I uh, here's the uh, the lift pump right here. Where my finger is on the line okay so there's the lift pump there's my wrench where I'm starting to take it off but then down here I can get a flashlight so everybody can see Sorry guys, it's kind of tough to get the shot I'm trying to show you. There we go. Right there. There's the lift pump, okay? So I had it plugged in uh, with my breakout lead and uh, I scoped, uh, like I said before, the power of the ground, uh, current to the pump, and uh, the pressure, okay? So let me get out of here and I'll put the uh, camera back on my head. And I'll go ahead and show you the capture that I had.
<clears throat> okay, so here's the first capture I did. Um, the uh, I did a long screen here at one minute and channel A uh, in blue is my lift pump voltage. Channel B in red is my lift pump ground circuit. Uh, channel C that's in green is my lift pump current. And channel D is the uh, pressure output of the uh, lift pump with my WPS 500. So now, let's do a little zoom in here. see what we got. Alright, so our pressure is at 4.9 PSI. Okay. Yeah, that's the pressure. Our current We're at about 3.986 amps. And then our ground side, um, I'm not too worried about the spikes because I think that's coming from uh, the pump, okay? Ground side, we got about 348 millivolts, okay? And that's in red, okay? So the power side goods, ground side's good. Uh, but the current though is kind of low. So what I did was is I did a uh, I've got a reference waveform of it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take away some. <coughs> captures here so I can see it. There it is. It's all the way over here in orange because I did it on a, uh, a faster time base. I think I did that one at 200 milliseconds. So anyway, let's take a look here, see what we got. See what the current is. Alright, at the very tip, at the peaks, where you're seeing these humps, that's the peak amperage for each one uh, for this lift pump motor, because it's, it's an electric motor, fellas, and ladies, if there's any ladies watching. Um, so anyway, the uh, amperage at the peak here is at 4.9 amps, or I'm not, uh, I'm sorry, that was the pressure, my bad, it's at 5 amps, <laughs> sorry. So 5.046 amps, all right? And then uh, the one on the suspect one, I'm only getting 3.986, okay? So that's proof right there, we've got a bad pump, okay? So, uh, oh, and I also verified and made sure there wasn't any fuel leaks, and there's no fuel leaks, nothing sucking air, so we have a bad pump, okay? So if I get time later, um, I'll try to shoot the after, probably not. I'll probably just have to show you the, uh, the after capture when I'm done, but I'll try to uh, get that up as soon as I can. So, uh, but anyway, um, let me uh, show you another capture I did. I kind of, I zoomed in on it too, because I wanted to see a little bit better clarity of uh, the lift pump current. So I did another one. Uh, let's see, which one was it? Here we go, faster time base. Let's open that one. All right, now, cool thing is you leave the your reference waveform on and it stays on. So all I gotta do is switch and it's back on here, okay? So now I'll just, uh, 
take the uh, channels off here just take off the ground and A get that out of the way and let's take a look and see what we got Now you also notice that, you know, my time base here, I'm at 200 milliseconds of division. And I've got good sample rate, 2 million samples. And if you notice, for channel C, which is the suspect current, notice how on this one, um, you don't see uh, humps as defined as you do on this brand new pump. This capture here was a brand new pump that I put on and did an own good on, okay? So I know that's a good pump. So anyway, you can see the difference here. This one has got humps to it. You can see it. The, the one on channel C was suspect. It's barely got anything. So let's do a zoom here. And there is a night and day difference here, okay? So you've got all these, uh, that's from the motor, you know, the current humps and everything, and the humps are more defined. So at peak here, you had about five, but then if you go down here, you're at four and a half amps, okay? You go here on channel C, to the very top there, and you might be at about, it's at four, it's a little bit closer. But still, I'm looking at the definition here. See how you've got nice, clean humps here, okay? Now, if you look at the one here on the bottom on channel C, it is not even close. It is all uh, botchy. It's missing beats. You know, it's the, the pump's junk, okay? It's just, it's going bad. So, so anyway, um, I thought I'd share that with you guys let you have another uh, taste of what I do um, so I'll try to keep on putting more stuff out when I can um, it all depends on the day and how busy we are uh, so um, I'll keep trying to pump out stuff when I can so anyway um, I hope everyone enjoyed this um, if you like it please give me a thumbs up okay and uh, and share if you'd like and then also um, I'd appreciate any comments um, um, I'm not perfect um, if something sees something that they'd like to add and tell me I'd more than appreciate it um, plus because I'm here to learn too I'm I learn every day okay and I don't know everything so uh, that's the beauty of uh, the type of work uh, the technicians do. We're always learning, we're always doing different things. So, anyway, uh, that's it. Hope everyone enjoyed it, and I hope everyone has a good day. Take care. Bye.